Hey guys, and Otto MCOC or Otto MCOC here again. And today we're going to be talking about a subject that's going to be a long way from now, but everybody is talking about it here and then. And it's going to be the 2022 gifting event. So why do I want to talk about the gifting event? We're in May and the gifting event starts in December. Well, that's because I've been preparing for the gifting event like a lot of other people are and as maybe some of you guys should as well. It's up to you, but um, I kind of started this project in January while I started my YouTube channel and I haven't been talking about it. So today I just wanted to talk about what I'm doing and you can copy whatever I'm doing if you want to. So first of all, I made a couple of accounts, new accounts, because I want to be able to gift myself for gifting event. And I don't want to be cheating. I just want to uh, take advantage of, of some of the opportunities that are in the game and um, so let's see what I did is I made a couple of accounts and I played on them a little here and there. So <clears throat> mainly my main focus is to um, do as little as possible uh, while still gaining some stuff for my accounts or for my main account. So I don't want to use a lot of time on my uh, mini accounts because I don't have a lot of time. And maybe you're in the same position. I don't know if you have a lot of time, you can even do more and I'm going to show you what I've done and you can copy that and you can, and I'll even tell you what you could do if you want to do more. So first of all, you make an account and then you go to the, the story content and you kind of start finishing acts and act one, act two, act three, has a lot of good rewards. A lot of these acts have a lot of units as you can see in here. So just finishing at one, two and three, 100% will give you around 2000 units. So that's a pretty good start. You will get to around 2,200 and it can be done fairly easy. You can, um, when you get to level 19, you can even do a lot of auto playing. So you don't have to do it yourself. And you can also try to accumulate your account if you want to. You don't you can join an alliance and get a few extra units here and there but you don't really have to do anything besides completing act one two and three 100 that that will give you above just around two thousand units so you can see i have almost ten thousand units on this account so i obviously obviously did more so last year they made a demand that you needed to finish act four to be eligible to do the gifting event and i actually found the the um, the clip they made, let me just see here. I have it right here. Let me put it on the screen. So this was the requirements as you see here. Those were the requirements to be eligible for the gifting event last year. You have to, from the 20th of December, those who are level 40 plus have to become conqueror by completing Act 4 and have created their accounts prior to November uh, 20th. 2021 can participate in this temporary gifting event so you can send gifting to other people and i've completed as you can see here i'll remove this again as you can see here i uh, i completed act four because i want to be eligible for 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 this event so i'm conqueror or proven or whatever it's called i'm, I'm not that much into the titles i didn't touch act five yet Act 4 doesn't have a lot of units when you complete it. So even though it makes sense to progress your account, I have not done it because I'm not super interested in getting a big account. I want as many accounts eligible as possible with the amount of units possible. So what else can I do to get more? Well, if you have time, what you can do with a limited time is you can go to the arenas and you can go to the to the summoner showdown and you can just do the two first milestones don't do anything else that's going to take you three times three fights so that's nine fights in total and you'll get 26 units you'll also get some battle chips that 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 might become units eventually but with nine fights you'll get 26 units so if you have four accounts that's around 100 units per three days you can add i haven't done this a lot on my accounts but i kind of want to because let's say it's 100 units per, per, per four accounts, then a week you can get 200 units uh, if you have four accounts running. I have five at the moment, but um, so let's say you have four accounts just to make the math easy. You can do 200 units a week by just doing nine fights in each account. 
Also, if you join uh, any alliance, you will have uh, the alliance events. You will have those three days events where you can do like one fight or two fights or whatever. I haven't even done one here, as you can see. And you'll be eligible to these uh, uh, rewards as well. Most alliances will, I can't go down here, will hit, um, will, don't care about the rank, will hit enough uh, milestones here uh, to get 25 units or 20 units. So that stacks up as well if you have more accounts and you can even do it. Besides that, you have the solo events. Uh, you have the level up events, you have the event completion events, and you can just <coughs> do these when you have time or whenever it's possible and just get the units. That's 25 extra units a day. Um, and it all stacks up. So <coughs> to make it uh, easier for me to figure out uh, how far am I and what can I do, I made another sheet and let me show you here. And I made a small mistake, as I can see here. I called the account title Proven, but it's actually Conqueror. And as you can see, I made a small sheet just to figure it out. Whoopsie, what happened here? There you go. Um, I made a goal that's called 1,000 uh, or 100K uh, units. And at the moment I have five accounts and only one account is, um, is below the level 40, it's 39. So that's gonna be easy. So I made an account number uh, what level is the account? What title does the account have? What's my top hero and what's the unit count? And then I can just update it uh, like once a month or whenever. And as you can see now, um, I play maybe 20, 25 minutes a day maximum on my mini accounts. And then sometimes for fun, I play on the account too, the one that's Cavalier, just for the stream. And I'm on almost 45,000 units combined. And that's like 20, 25 minutes a day. Uh, you get some units from the lock-in calendar. Sometimes you get some battle chips, and it all stacks up. And I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna do like a monthly or 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 maybe every second month do an update here on the gifting event and how I am approaching it, so you can see how far I'm going. Um, so maybe it would be a good idea for you guys to start, and maybe it won't. But here's a. I, I hope you learned something from this and ask questions if you have those in the comments. And uh, I hope you prepare well and let me know if you have any tips or tricks for me to do with my uh, small accounts getting ready for gifting. And uh, hopefully all of you will be ready for the 2022 gifting event when it comes. And um, I'll see you on the stream. Thank you.